welcome back to my channel and today's video is actually a Birchbox limited edition video so here is the limited edition box this is the Birchbox rock my wedding box so I've got one week and six days until my wedding when filming this but when you see this I will have 10 days left until my wedding I personally wasn't going, well I wanted to get this but then I thought no I don't have a, enough money to get this but then I was just sort of browsing the website, you know how it goes and I popped it into my basket to see that I had a 15% discount and then on top of that I was able to use my £5 off friend referral money so actually this box is meant to be £29 and I only paid £20 and 40p so I thought do you know what, why not? What I am going to say is this is a treat to me from me and after the wedding I am going to be brutally honest with you guys and start setting some really honest boundaries to be quite honest with you. So yeah, anyway, back into the Birch Box Rock My Wedding box and this is what it looks like on the outside. It's bigger than the usual Birch, birch Boxes itself. It's a navy blue which is actually sort of the colour theme of my wedding and then we've got just a nice floral design on it and it opens up like so and then on the inside it says your wedding um, it doesn't actually say that at all it says your day your way then it has some white tissue paper and a gold sticker obviously I know some of the contents in this box because I wanted to know if it was worth my money I think for £20 it is, so here is the content inside. So like any birch box you do get the little leaflet inside just to explain a little bit more about the products inside and actually what I didn't realise it actually says what, what is in here which is full size which is perfect. So I'm going to dig in at no particular order and pull out an item. The first item here is the OK Bright, Bright Eyes Gold Dust Under Eye Mask. Where are you? Where are you? Hmm. Where is it? Where is it on here? Oh, it's the second one down. So this is a full size product and this gold foil eye masks. If you can't indulge in a little luxury before your nuptials, when can you? These soothing under eye masks can be used anywhere, anytime, although you might get a few funny looks if you wear them down the aisle. <laughs> Enrich with gold and honey extracts, they'll nourish, hydrate and depuff your peepers. Place the patches under your eyes for 20 to 30 minutes before massaging in any excess serum. Okay, I think I do actually own a set of these from a advent calendar that I got last year. Um, I'm yet to use them, but actually, in all honesty, will I use these on my wedding day? Probably not, because I have packed something a little bit different for my wedding day. But excited to give them a go nonetheless, and it will all come in handy for the truths behind in later times, if that makes sense. So the next item is this one here. Now this is another full size item, it is the Space Mask Self Heating Eye Mask. Pre-wedding jitters mean that it can be hard to switch off. Luckily, space masks are here to make it a little easier to unwind. Infused with mood-calming jasmine, they help to soothe the senses for a much-needed moment of calm. Plus a thin layer of ironing fillings inside the mask, entwine with oxygen molecules in the air, so they will gently heat up on your skin, so relax. Open up the pouch and place over your eyes, hook the elastics over your ears, to keep it in place and leave for 15 minutes while you sit back and enjoy some time out and just pop or just pop it on just before bed okay um i do also have one of those from a birch box as well again i'm yet to use it it's not good but those were two items that I wasn't too fussed about whether getting in the box or not. It was more some of the makeup y items that I was interested in within this box anyway. Digging in again, what am I going to get? I think the next item is a makeup brush. So this is the Carl Creatives 8 brush. We can't guarantee that your your great aunt won't start on an argument or 
or the bar won't run out of wine. But thanks to the synthetic brushes, we can assure you your makeup will blend with perfection on your wedding day. Multi-use, it's perfect for highlight, eyeshadow and concealer. Plus the squared handle means it, it'll it never roll out of reach. That is a clever thing. <laughs> so it says win. Use a lightly... Use to lightly sweep eyeshadow across the lids, buff highlighter onto your cheekbones or pat concealer under your eyes. You guys know how I feel about brushes, I'm not going to go into it. I do like the fact that this one will never roll away, because I am forever losing my brushes that do roll away. Um, I like the fun tropical colour on it, because obviously it is... Um, I am personally getting married abroad, so I quite like the fun colour handle. I don't know if I pack this in my actual holiday makeup brush set, but we'll find out nearer the time. Not that you can get much nearer than this. <laughs> um, I don't know how much these items are, but I will, as always, try and leave them on the screen for you anyway, so you'll know how much this product is. Next item at random is a Nails Ink product. You guys know, or you may know, that I do actually really love the Nails Ink formula. This is a nail polish in the shade Nude Girl, um, full size I believe. Let me just actually have a little read to double check. So Nails Ink, send in nude nail polish in Nude Girl. This is a full size product to finalise so many details months in advance. Dress the venue, the extremely material malicious seating plan that last minute prep is often overlooked so we've sort of sorted your marital moment manicure with this sentiment semi matte long wearing violet cream polish the delicate hue will complement every gown the ring bouquet and skin tone apply two coats of polish before sealing with a top coat i actually already know what nail polish i'm using for my wedding day is a red one no false nails in sight I made a promise this year and I've stuck to it so far. Um, but this one would be nice for just holiday in general or just a normal everyday nude. So I'm not mad at that because I do like the Nails Ink polishes but I'm just not bothered for my wedding day as such. I do like the polish. So the next item is this by a brand called Floral Street. I have actually seen this floating around in a couple of boxes just recently. So let's see... This is the Floral Street Fragrance Discovery Set. The slightest hint of perfume can instantly trigger memories and transport you back in time. So there's no better day than your wedding to experiment with fragrance. Consider this set your matchmaker from exotic and sultry to citrusy and bright. It's the perfect way to choose your powerful scent for your big day. Spritz directly onto your pulse points. Try layering to create a unique to you scent. Now, how many do you get in here? Let's have a little look. You've got London Poppy, Wonderland Pe Peony, Neon Rose, Wild Vanilla Orchid, Irish Goddess, Chipri Sublime, Black Lotus, Ylang Ylang Espresso. So I'm quite intrigued by a couple of these. I don't know if you guys watched the video where I said I was interested in um buying a fragrance for my wedding day there was um a machino one in my empty empties which i was really intrigued to get but i don't think that's going to really happen i'm just going to spray one of these this is the irish goddess i just don't know if these would be big enough <laughs> think that one is the one <laughs> but we'll see how we get on it's a nice little trial kit and just to see how we get on on the big day so we have a item here which I do believe is a mini or deluxe mini and this is the Smashbox super fan fanned out mascara I love their play on words there especially with the fact that it says fan because I did actually create create my own sort of photo challenge for the wedding day and I had a play on words with that as well so that's quite funny and um, so this is a smashbox super fan mascara flake free clump free larger than life lashes have never been easy to achieve with this ultra black long lasting mascara with a 360 precision double ended brush it catches every single lash delivering volume length without weighing them down non smudge false lash effect as it's bright to be dream come true 
Sweep the brush from root to tip, add a second coat to build length and volume as desired. I'm not going to open it, you guys know how I feel about opening products before I'm ready to use them, especially mascaras as they do dry out, but I will be intrigued to see how this performs. I'm sure it will be rolled in before long within my makeup collection, shop my stash video. So. <laughs> so here we have a little boxed item. This is the... Quarterly Vino Perfect Dark Spot Correcting Glycolic Night Cream. Rev up your radiance with this overnight cream that gently benefit, gently brightens, corrects, exfoli exfoliates and renews skin. Phew. Best used a month before or so the big day. So you really see results. It's a prohibited combination of glycolic acid, sheer butter, hyaluronic acid and antioxidants will leave you with airbrushed glowing skin. Apply a thick layer to clean skin nightly before hitting the sec. Recommended a month before my wedding is slight disappointment because I have less than two weeks. But I'll just leave this here and try it when I get home. It's quite a nice sort of um, 15 mil size in nice packaging. Like it doesn't look like it would be a sample. It is a sample. It doesn't actually state it's a full size product because obviously it's not. But it's nice to see it in a more nice packaging, I guess. <laughs> the next brand here is a brand called Anasui. I Anasui, sorry. I have used this brand before in terms of perfumes, and I really have enjoyed the perfumes that I've had from this brand. This is a lip colour top coat with instant photos. That doesn't say that at all. It says, with constant photos, one million family members to catch up with, and 1am dance floor sing-alongs. You might might have thought that your lip colour would be flaking before the first dance. Not with this top coat, it's all mattify your pout and prevent any smudging, transferring or fading whilst boosting hydration with a peach and almond oils. Shake the tube before squeezing the top coat onto your fingers or a brush and swiping over your lipstick. So this I'm assuming is a little bit like a lip coat where it just locks in any um, colour. Packaging on the inside is quite simple, um, it's clearly not a full size, oh it does actually say this is a full size product, oh, okay, well we'll see how we get on with that. Originally a Japanese brand but this came from a UK branch in case you're wondering, okie dokie. I love the outside packaging though, tempted to leave it in there just for that. <laughs> So there's two more items in the box, they just so happen to be the two items I was probably most excited for. Uh, I think that they're both not full size. Yeah, they're both not full size but it's fine. Gives me a good excuse to try them. Uh, I'm going to start with my second to least favourite. This one is a Bobbi Brown lipstick. Now I do actually own a Bobbi Brown lipstick from one of my advent calendars. I can't remember which one because I had quite a few. But this is the Bobbi Brown Crushed Lip Colour in the shade Babe. When it comes to bridal beauty, finish, finishing touches makes all the difference. This luxe rose hues lipstick is perfectly suited to your special day. Loaded with crushed pigments and vitamins, it has a chicness of a lipstick but the hydrate of a balm. The satin texture means it's comfortable wear and easy to touch up to. Swipe straight onto the lips from the bullet, building more if you prefer an intense colour. So it's obviously got a pinky hue as it's just mentioned. It must be a nude of some description I would assume. But I already know what lip colour I'm using. I'm literally like 99.9% .9 sure. Okay it's more like a ready pinky shade more pinky red than pinky nude actually there's a fair amount of product in there though i have to admit and the packaging is super cute so you can't complain about that the final one is all wrapped up in this sort of polystyrene type bag it's definitely the one i was most excited to receive something i was hoping to try at some point this year and it is a becca highlight I believe it's in one of their standout shades. So this is the Shimmering Skin Perfect Depressed Highlighter in Opal. A lit from within glow is a wedding day must have. 
and this award-winning highlighter iconic formula adjusts to your skin undertones to amplify your natural radiance with an ultra buttery texture that melts into the skin you can build it's to go bold or embrace a subtle shimmer. Either way, you'll fall in love with the elegant finish. Apply to the features you want to accentuate. We recommend the cheekbones and your brow and the bridge of your nose and in the inner corner of your eyes. So just a normal standard highlighted area. Uh, I'm not going to swatch this yet because I do. I'm just going to take this on my holidays and enjoy it there. I really think that I will enjoy it. It is a well known, well loved product. And I'm glad to get it in a sample size. Highlighters are a pain to actually pan. I've panned one in my lifetime. And I'm getting to the point where I am going to start curating my collection a lot. A lot. That's all I'm going to say. A lot. And you will see why in videos to come. But am I happy with this box? Yes. Do I think it's worth £20? Absolutely. £29? Yeah. Definitely. There's 10 items. So they come to around £2.90 an item. If you pay in the full price, you get free delivery, which is brilliant. But if you are like me and you have been a Birchbox subscriber for a while, um, before six months, I believe, you get a 10% discount. After six months, you get a 15% discount. And then also, as I mentioned, you lovely people do sometimes use my referral code, which gives me a £5 discount. I don't very often use that discount, I have to admit, but it did come in handy this time round. So thank you guys ever so much. Uh, you'll be pleased to know that I will be sharing my big day with you at some point. I will be trying to vlog on my holidays. I don't know how much I'll get vlogged on the actual wedding day, but we do have a videographer now, so I'm super excited for that. And I just cannot wait to share my big day with you guys. And it's less than two weeks away now. So if you did enjoy this video, please give me a big thumbs up. Do you think any of these items were like essentials for your big day? Let me know in the comments down below, especially if you are already married. And I will see you all in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.